Why, hello there. Jacob. And today, I have not one, but two jerseys to share with you. So without further ado, let's go ahead and dive right into this. So yeah, these particular jerseys, I should say, come to us from Fanatics. Well, about... Well, hell, I honestly don't know how long ago it's been, but I know on Friday, last Friday when I got paid, these puppies were on sale for a grand total of about 168 bucks for both of them. And I think for the first one, I paid about 70 for it. And the bottom one, I paid also about 70, 75 or something. But anyway, regardless, both of these jerseys totaled out to be about 168 bucks. And what was even crazy about that is, well, let's just say, literally a couple days later, these were on sale for even cheaper. I think the first one I saw was as cheap as about 60 bucks, and the bottom one was still roughly about 70, 75 bucks or so. But, uh, yeah. <laughs> so, without further ado, let's not waste any more time. So, yeah, jersey number one comes to us from the NFC West. That's right, ladies and gentlemen. These are two NFL jerseys. And this particular bad boy, well, I should say this particular player, on jersey number one, was a number three overall pick in 2021. And also, shout-outs to... Resurrection and Bay Area Throwbacks. That is right, ladies and gentlemen. This particular bad boy right here is a Trey Lance Nike Vapor Elite jersey. And this particular bad boy comes to us in a size 60. So, without further ado, let's go ahead and show this bad boy off. So, yeah, like I say, this is a Trey Lance Vapor Fuse. And uh, I love the white San Francisco 49ers jerseys and stuff like that. They're very nice. They're very beautiful. And, uh, yeah, so as you can see here, this has the NFL Chrome Shield with the uh, grill, like, flywire mesh of the old, you know, Vapor's Elites and stuff like that. The 49er uh, word mark above the 5, which I know they changed that a couple years ago. The 5 on the front. And like I say, this is a size 60. Lance on the back on a sewn nameplate, and the nameplate looks absolutely huge compared to the uh, letters and stuff like that. Granted, I don't know if that was how they uh, did these. I don't know if, you know, they're supposed to be a little bit bigger or whatnot or whatnot, but uh, yeah. And then the five single stitched on the back, and uh, yeah, I mean, what more can you say? Trey Lance, I still think, has a future in the NFL and stuff like that. It's just San Francisco never really gave him the time of day and stuff like that. So, honestly, maybe, like, in the future, depending on what Dallas does with Dak and that and all that stuff, we'll just kind of wait and see if he takes over for the Dallas Cowboys or if he ends up traded somewhere else. And also, too, forgot to mention... Zay stripes, which are like screen printed on, but everything else is sewn down and all that stuff. So, yeah. First jersey is Trey Lance. And of course, too, for me, you know, it's kind of nice having a Trey Lance jersey because, well, he's from nearby Marshall, Minnesota, went to North Dakota State, and again was a number three overall draft pick. I mean,. <laughs> The dude can ball and stuff like that. I just hope that he can stay healthy and he can finally have the time of day to actually potentially show off what he can do. But, uh, yeah, that's jersey number one. The road white 
Trey Lance Vapor. And now for jersey number two. This particular uh, jersey is also from the NFC West. And this particular player was the number one overall draft pick in 2019. Boom. That is right, ladies and gentlemen. This is a Kyler Murray, Arizona Cardinals, Vapor Elite. And the reason why this one was heavily discounted as much as it was is because, well, this past offseason, going into 2023, they changed up their jerseys, basically. They kind of went with more of like a, a minimalistic, futuristic look, which honestly, I still don't know how I feel about them. I, I wasn't a huge fan when they changed from this style to what they have now, even though I know a lot of people would agree, though, that they needed to change. I mean, because these things are harkening back from like 2006, 2005, and I mean, they're nice jerseys and stuff like that. They did have some good history in these, including making the Super Bowl run in 2008. But, yeah, I mean, like I say, Kyler Murray, Vapor Elite. So let's go ahead and get into it. So yeah, the Cardinals jerseys are kind of unique, because as you can see, the stitching of the Cardinal, here is the price tag and all that stuff. Also has that uh, shiny chrome NFL shield with the chainmail grill vapor fuse, or like the vapor style. And if I remember right, this particular number is, yep, this is a kiss cut number on the front here. And this is also a size 60. Has the one on the shoulders, the Nike swoosh, the like paneling and stuff like that with the cuff sleeves Murray on the back which is like a kiss cut on the uh, sewn nameplate and the kiss cut one on the back with the upside down Y design of the vapor elites and of course that cardinal logo and, uh, yeah, I mean, not really much else to say about Kyler Murray. I mean, when he was drafted number one overall, he actually looked like a really, really solid player. And then, you know, there were some character things, some clashes with him and Cliff Kingsbury. Then he gets injured towards the tail end of last year. And, well, he just came back a couple weeks ago, and it looks like he's lighting it up a little bit more. So, who knows? Maybe Kyler Murray is indeed the answer in Arizona. It might have just been Cliff Kingsbury. It might have been the old regime. I don't know, but like I say, we'll just kind of wait and see here. But yeah, that'll wrap up this round of pickups. So yeah, like I say, here's the Trey Lance Road White 49ers Vapor Elite. And the Kyler Murray Home Red Cardinal burgundy kind of you know red home jersey so uh yeah that'll basically wrap up this video and also in case i don't get to it beforehand hope everyone has a happy thanksgiving hopefully everyone has a safe and you know <laughs> effective holiday season because i know the holidays are coming up and you know literally thanksgiving is two days from today from which i'm recording and uh yeah, I mean, hopefully everyone has a happy and healthy Thanksgiving and a happy and healthy holiday season. Again, I want to give shout-outs to uh, Bay Area Throwback, Resurrection, King Leonidas for getting me hooked on these Vapor Elites and Vapor Fuse jerseys and stuff like that. And uh, go check these three guys out. I mean, like I say, they've been instrumental in like my elites and like you know just overall good guys on my channel and stuff like that also shout out to mighty mouse fan shout out to all the jersey heads on there and stuff like that and yeah so until we meet again this is jacob have a good day